Hello, this is the Hedgeman with Game Maker Shooter Tutorial 2.5. If you were just watching 2.0, you know that I ran out of time, ran over on the 15 minute time limit, had to split this in half. So, in this bit, we'll be covering how to create bullets and how to create a new character so that your character can shoot in two different directions. Um, that will be the next bit, so let's get started. So, the first thing we need to do for creating a bullet is a bullet sprite. I've already got mine. So, whatever projectile you intend to use, create that sprite, load that sprite. Alright, pause the game, whatever you need to do. So, once you have that sprite, you need to create an object. So, go up here, create an object. Bullet. And click OK. Next, open up your player. Well, actually, correction. You need to select your sprite first. There you go. So, open up your player. Click Add Event, Key Release, Space. Or whichever button you're using. I'm using Space to fire my gun. First thing you need to do there is add an event of a moving object. Now, this applies to yourself. Select object, bullet. Now here, X and Y. This is a complicated bit. So go ahead and click OK. We'll come back to that in a second. And go to your room. Now you need to figure out how far in pixels the point where you want the object created is if you just want it created at the beginning point where your character starts which would be for me let's see here if I start here that's 24208 I type that in that be that would be 00, zero would be where I wanted it created which would be here 24208 this is this is kinda confusing so just bear with me so what I'm going to do to simplify this process is clear a little space over here get rid of my background so you can see stuff better and recreate my player right here at zero zero right so now I want my bullets to start here or pretty close to here actually so So go over here and click in zero zero. I'm gonna want my bullets to start close to here. We're here at a uh, eighty forty eight. That's where I want my bullet to spawn. So what I need to do is use this number here in the x and y coordinates of create instance of moving object. So go ahead and close your room. Don't save the changes, by the way. And go back to creating instance of moving object. For me, those numbers are 80 and 48. I don't know what they are for you. You need to figure that out like I just showed you. But for speed, I'm going to set mine to 20. You don't need to change your direction if you want the bullet to go right, or your projectile, whatever you're using. Also, take the relative box and click OK. Click OK again. Now that we've got that, let's test it out. So click the Run the Game button. Now that your window is open, test my movement there a little bit, try hitting your firing button. For me, it generates bullets. Notice though, if you turn around, they come out the same side. In order to correct this, you have to create a sprite for the opposite direction. So let's go back to the menu here and do that. We need an object using your sprite from earlier. So what you need to do is go to sprite, edit, reverse the direction like I showed you earlier. 
mirror flip okay. and create an object using the sprite once you've done that click OK don't need to change anything in that menu now the next bits complicated and requires some tricky movement with your character what we need to do is create a duplicate of your character here so go ahead and duplicate that character and you'll need to, you can leave that the way it is click OK now go back to your main player and select press left instead of having just the change sprite here we're also going to want to have change instance you're going to change your instance into the other player click player left and select perform event yes click OK and click OK down here now for the opposite player do the reverse open press right change instance your original character perform events yes and click OK now I'm going to show you why that's important the firing bullet process using space here creates an object moving that direction unfortunately that doesn't work if you turn the other way around so go ahead and open up player left for me which is whatever you have named yours which is the new character so go ahead and open up instance of moving object and set x to zero click ok actually yeah, yeah go ahead and click ok next you need to make a bullet left if you haven't and change bullet to bullet left click OK and for direction actually we need to set this to 180 click OK again and OK and let's try running the game moving around a little try shooting shoots to the left shoots to the right left right that's going to cover it for part th two we'll continue in part three where I'll show you how to create enemies and obstacles how to change rooms and how to improve your play in the game for more videos visit us at thetechies.com and thanks for watching